So the exact moment of this full moon that we'll be talking about today is technically in the early hours of Wednesday morning when the moon will not be visible in the sky here in Chicago. So that means that really Tuesday or Wednesday night are both great nights for observing this uh, beaver supermoon. So this is a name that has been used. You know, we have different sort of names that refer to all of the different full moons throughout the year based on the month that they occur in. These days, these names are just catchy names that we can use to remember what part of the year it is. But in the past, these were a little bit more telling and helpful for people's connections with nature. So this time of year was when beavers would be building their dams up, getting ready for the cold winter, which it seems like they are right on time based on what I heard from your meteorologist mm -hmm. before this. The supermoon part of that name is because this full moon is happening close to our moon's perigee. Perigee is a term used for when the moon is closest in its orbit. Its orbit is not a perfect circle. It's a little bit of an oval, so sometimes it's closer, sometimes it's further away. When a full moon aligns with that closest distance, we call that a supermoon. This will be happening at night. We should have lots of fun, good opportunities to observe something as big and bright as the full moon. So this is something that you can really see from anywhere. Catch the latest on this story at Fox 32 on Fox Local.